Hi and welcome back to another video in this channel. My name is Martha Makwata. If you're seeing my face for the very first time, as usual, you're new here. Kindly remember to subscribe and just support this channel. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers and this journey is proving quite tedious. So please, if you haven't subscribed and you're watching, remember to subscribe. So back to our video. Today, um, uh, we are having a video on our monthly haul. I wish I asked you because some things can be seen right here. <laughs> I wish I asked you to guess. But now you know we are having a video on our monthly haul, our monthly shopping, our grocery shopping. Normally, I do my grocery once a month, sometimes once in two months when we are fewer in the home. But right now we are, I can say we are three quarters, just one person is missing. So I know we will be preparing lunches, we will be preparing dinners, and we will be preparing breakfasts. So we have to really be prepared. And I know that during the month, there are so, so many other things that I'll have to keep topping up. You know, teenagers. So let's get right into it. I've talked enough. I was not keen on closing my kitchen door, but I've uh, discovered I'm having competing voices from uh, the television in the sitting room. So I had to close it. So let's get into our shopping. Uh, this snack, you already know it. Wow. Party pack rings. This one is normally bought for football nights. They really enjoy having it. It's 500 grams and it is that big. Then I bought two packs of uh, tissues. This is 10 plus 2. Our usual 10 are tissues. So that makes it 24 pieces. I still have one full pack that is not opened and about half, about 6 pieces. So that means we have around 40 pieces of tissue. So that will push us well. Then this one is a snack that my youngest really loves. Uh, my teenage, my teenager son, teenage son. He really loves this. Kindly comment below if you have a son who loves this. Him, he loves... Uh, salty snacks if you want to bless him just give him salty snacks and he will be very grateful so yes enough about my son and uh, salty snacks uh, i bought this 500 grams sausages uh yeah i bought these donuts and uh, by there the main shopping was done at Cafo, the hub but this one was bought earlier at Food Plus Chandarana this same day, today. That's why I've showed you. And these are ground nuts. That is 500 grams. Uh, together with this milk, I bought it also, the three packets. I bought it at Chandarana. At Kafo, I bought this KCC lactose free, which was missing in the market. It has been off market for a while i think the last time i saw this milk was around the time the nairobi show was happening i hope you will hear me nicely i just discovered yesterday that my phone i have a new phone and uh, i cannot use my 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 microphone on it the port is different so i'll have to look for a microphone but in the meantime, let's enjoy watching. I hope you can hear me well, well. So yes, that's our lactose-free milk. We, these ones, of course, I normally say we'll keep adding because they use it in their cereals. I'm planning to buy milk for their cereals. But in the meantime, 
of course they will use what we have okay for oil cooking oil i bought this two liter rina and they are different just because of the price and i bought that rinsan five liters that five liters was going at 13 13 55 i will check and just comment below it was on offer from 16 something to 13 something then this one was the best uh, priced for the two liters that's why i picked it <clears throat> sorry for that my son insisted on this this one goodness of natural tomato i don't even know said okay it's ketchup he said it has some tangy feeling some tangy taste we'll 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 test it and see how it is kapute he says there's a classmate who really loves it and he tested and it is nice so let's test and see i bought five kgs of sugar we still have some in the house hey i hope i've not put you guys upside down let me just check and so yeah the kakira sugar is there mm, here is jaggery for my husband he normally picks it for himself i think he keeps it in the office when he feels like his sugars are down he will have that then i bought uh five kgs rice uh no seven kgs rice there's another one here this one here i had placed it in a different place this one is two key kgs yeah as you can see here and this other one is five kgs let me just focus well yeah there there yeah and that is the brand i love so much i took this witabix uh witabix oatbix <laughs> one kg uh yeah this one you can guess who bought it you if you checked my youngest shopping back to school he's the one who loves chocolate spread i can't stand it so he bought it for himself normally i buy margarine for baking and i got this prestige margarine here yeah so to our breakfast cereals i think we still have witabix they don't really love witabix i'll not buy a big pack again i've learned the hard way so once that one gets over i'll see but this cornflakes it is eaten hey this one he was even telling me mama you might have to buy it after two weeks so this is one kg of cornflakes uh this one is uh this i guess is the dad's normally when he travels he carries uh, some of the cereals that he uses then back here let me just focus these are uh, popcorn sorry i've dropped something on the floor that is two kgs popcorn right there let me minimize this a bit yeah right there and what dropped is this uh, coconut cream powder it is down here don't mind my stand our light is right here light right there so coconut powder i bought some four packets i thought i took five packets but that will be good for us then there's that this cereal that gives me a hard time uh pronouncing dried fruits and honey it has raisins cranberry apricot almonds since it is a very nice one i hope i'll be able to taste but that's my husband's so yeah let's continue
So there's something I didn't show you that drink. I don't love the picture on it, but it seems my youngest son really loves it. So and to our cereals are they called cereals okay whatever the flowers i bought two packets mandazi flour i still have two packets i know with the school closed schools closed i'll have to prepare mandazis maybe every week so that's why I'm prepared with that. Then for EXC All Purpose, I bought two packets. I guess I still have one packet. Then for Chapati, I bought three packets. I still have one packet. Then I bought this Soko maize meal. Pray for me. It has been a, an uphill task going to the meal. We call it Kisiagi in Kenya. So I hope I'll be able to go this time round. I had shown you this rice. That's why I'm not showing it again. Then I bought 2 kgs of uh, Wimby. This brand here. I normally love it very much. The Wimby, the porridge is quite smooth. I hope you've tasted and you can comment below if you've tasted. I've met some of my my subscribers who say they tested and for sure it is smooth i'm not promoting it i'm just sharing a good product that a sister discovered then himalayan salt this is what we use uh, for our stews and what have you then i bought these eggs two trays and by bad luck one is broken I'm just waiting to finish so that I remove it so that it doesn't leak. Then I bought this watermelon which they just want to cut and enjoy right away. Then around here, let me just turn to that side. Excuse the cable. So right here I have a mixture of things. Let me just try and arrange. Okay, I bought tomatoes. A bag was going at 109 shillings. So I bought two packs which are here. And uh, we've opened and used this one. We used it to cook our dinner. I also opened and used some carrots. This is a pack of carrots. Let me just turn it and see. Uh, the pack was going at 132. I know that if I find time and go to the market, the prices will be very favorable. I hope I'll be able to go to the market. I don't know why the focus is not good. Yeah, that is better. Yeah, that was 132 for that. Then I bought sweet potatoes, which were going at. Uh, 153 as you can see here then we remember to buy bulbs there's one of my bulbs my kitchen bulbs let me just show you it has been off for a while excuse the lighting this is the bulb I'm talking about. It has been off for a while. And uh, today I remembered to buy a bulb. We are going to have it uh, in, inserted or installed. However. <laughs> so back to our shopping. I had shown you this bulb. That's what made me to go and uh, show you from the other end. And I bought two. Our sitting room bulb also blue this evening. So we are going to install. I normally have two bulbs in my living room. So one of them blue. So we are going to install. That is my kettle. The one I use. That's my my blender <laughs> so they are just on the counter 
So back here, mm, what haven't I shown you? This one, <laughs> it's a kid's detangler. I've looked for an, a detangler, detangling conditioner, and I didn't find. So I decided to just take this kid's detangler and use. I want to wash my hair tomorrow. I might go to the salon. Then toothbrush for my husband. He has been using his for more than three months now. So he bought this one for himself. This one was bought by my last, my youngest. <laughs> then uh, we bought this. If you are an ardent watcher of my videos, you know that we use this one. So I bought two packs of 130 grams each there is one i opened recently and i've just discovered i have another one then i bought a uh, life boy uh, we had to go down a bit anyway life boy is as good so we bought life boy and there are six pieces hopefully that will carry us through the month then i bought these plaques uh, mouthwash I don't use it daily I was told I was advised that if you use mouthwash daily it kills the good bacteria in your throat so normally I gargle with salt this is for my second born son and he just tasted it and told me hmm mama it has a spotty uh, scent to it this is uh, smooth shave i think this one is my husband's i think i'm not sure then this one i think this was my youngest then there's this of course for our shoes that may need brushing then there's this soap powder soap i still have some i think i can show you the soap that i still have let me see if I'll be able to show you. I'll just show the I'll just show you the soap. I feel that I feel as if I'm not speaking well. So this is the uh, Max Fresh Cold Gate that we still have, and this is one packet of uh, soap that I still have. And uh, for the bar soap, I still have this full one. There is another half in the drawers and there is this half here. So that's why I bought half of it. Then um, this place is not organized, forgive it, but this is what we have here. So I have sufficient, you see, I still have a lot of these. I still have this. And I still have steel wool in its numbers. This is our refilling uh, hand wash, magni for cleaning the glasses. And I still have pledge for our furniture. So, and I still have powder, scoring. I have vim and I have this and I have toilet wash. So you see, I still have enough of that. Let me move to the ungas. Uh, you see, I told you I had two packets of these. Uh, mandazi. I have one jogo here from last time. And I have one EXE chapati, one EXE all purpose. And uh, some spices. Let me just move there and show you. Forgive the disorganization, but... This is where I normally keep our extra spices that are not yet opened. Oregano, I have cinnamon, I have paprika, and I have that tomato sauce. Yeah, this is also oregano. I, I have several packets of oregano. This is sage. Yeah. So, and table salt. So for tea leaves, why I didn't get it, we still have all this. You see this one, these two are not open. And this one is the one that is opened and it's now finished. 
I sent my youngest to pick so that's why he did not throw away the box so this one is to be thrown away I still have a lot of things around here let me just show you uh, the Witterbix. this one is the slowest eaten thing in this house this house sorry <laughs> they have eaten it so slowly so yeah let me throw this box away i'll take time to arrange this place I hope. yeah and up there our tissues as you can see so this is the one one full pack that is not yet opened I guess with that, we've come to the end of our haul, of our shopping, and uh, thanks for watching. If you've watched until this point, thank you very much for your support. And uh, just remember to like this video, remember to subscribe, and remember to share and even comment. Comment something down here, how you're surviving right now with this hard economic times. So until the next one, bye for now.